is Shannon Curtis. I'm the PTO president here at Lewis Anna Woodbury Elementary School. If you ask them their favorite subject, would say art class for sure. My son looks forward to it every week. And she also volunteers in our community. She does um, Girl Scouts every Tuesday. She's an active member of our PTO. And um, she does art club here at the school every Thursday with over 50 students she has here um, every single Thursday after school for an hour and a half. So there is no doubt in my mind that Kim deserves the title of Teacher of the Year. In our community, our Teacher of the Year also believes in instilling a passion for the arts. She is involved in multiple art festivals and also related musical festivals, both inside our community base and surrounding areas. She wants to spread her love for the arts through children and adults. Mrs. Finley is a second grade teacher at our school, and she is also our Teacher of the Year. I have known Ms. Finley for several years, and I am extremely impressed with the way that she builds a family atmosphere in her classroom every year. She creates positive relationships with everyone she comes in contact with, and not only that, but she maintains them through the years. She is a leader on our campus, and she always goes above and beyond, not only for the kids that are assigned to her classroom, but for any student that we find that needs assistance. She's the best teacher in the world. I love Ms. Finley because she teaches me math. Ms. Finley is a very supportive teacher. Being only my second year at BEA, if I need anything, she is the go-to person. Thank you, Ms. Finley, for being part of the BEA family. Congratulations. Our Teacher of the Year is uh, Jimmy Lynch, and Mr. Lynch is fairly new to Bartow Middle School. He's been teaching, this is going into his third year now at Bartow Middle School. He's a career changer, uh, came to us from a, a different field, a paralegal field, and um, he, he's just done a phenomenal job over the past two years. He continues to grow as a teacher. Um, he's very eager to see his students every day. He's eager to see his uh, peers and his colleagues that he works side by side with every day. He's the first one on our campus every morning preparing lessons for uh, students, getting everything organized. When I first met Mr. Lynch, I was the social studies department head. After talking with him for just a few minutes, I said, I can tell you're going to be great at this job. Of course, coming from a different profession into teaching, Mr. Lynch had a lot of wake-up calls. As many who come from the business world find out, teaching is an entirely different kind of job. By the end of his first year, Mr. Lynch had shown amazing determination and growth. Carrie Brown, Teacher of the Year for Bartow High School, IB, and Summerlin Academy, has the uncanny ability to communicate with all audiences, whether it be students, parents, community members, business partners, or staff members. She has a heart for students that shines through in everything she does. With seemingly little effort, she's able to calm students' fears, encourage staff, and offer confident feedback to business partners and community members. As a classroom teacher instructing students in leadership and student government, she communicates 21st century skills to those students. She provides them with collaborative opportunities as well as numerous leadership opportunities. With a positive outlook, she teaches the students the value of hard work, the importance of accountability and responsibility, and that nothing is too difficult for any of them. Um, we make banners and just decorate the school, make it look pretty and try to uh, make everyone have school spirit. And whenever we can't solve problems ourselves, um, Ms. Brown is very good at like you know, teaching us and helping us learn like good life lessons. She will do anything she can to help other people and it's just a part of her heart and who she is. When you walk into Miss Mayer's classroom you can just see the excitement in the students eyes as they're learning and discovering. She takes the time to support each individual need of her students her patience and compassion is evident in all of her interactions with them. Who's in this story? Water or Nancy and Turtle? 
absolutely aren't. I love Miss Maya Miss Clayton because they're the best teacher ever. They teach me about math. Salad! First, we need some oranges! Oh, yeah. Check! Check! Then we need some pineapple chunks! My Hi, my name is Ms. Hardy. I'm the principal of Fort Meade Middle Senior, and I am proud to have Ms. Mills as our Teacher of the Year. She's an absolute natural. She was a Polk County student herself, but you go into her room and she has all the students engaged. It's a safe place for error analysis, and she picks up on things that you don't even have to teach her. Um, so again, she is the best selection for Fort Meade Middle Senior as our Teacher of the Year. Congratulations, Ms. Mills. You really deserved it. Congratulations, Ms. Mills. Congratulations, Ms. Mills. Congratulations, Ms. Mills! Our Teacher of the Year, Ms. Denise Witten for Goss Academy, is a great teacher from uh, experience of many years. She's brought that to our school. She teaches English to our students and our students are always excited to be in her room for her creativity and her innovativeness. We are so thankful that Ms. Denise Witten has been nominated as our Teacher of the Year for God's Academy. Well, Mr. Bronco is one of our math teachers here. Um, he is also the department head for the math department, um, as well as he's also a sponsor of one of our clubs on campus. He teaches some of the hardest content on campus within the math area, um, and then continuously has success with those students. You know, the kids just can't help but listen to him. He's, he's extremely funny in the classroom, and he uh, is brilliant as a mathematician as well, too. So um, what he's able to bring to his kids on a daily basis in the classroom is, is phenomenal. There's not a day goes by that if you're around Mr. Morocco that you're not laughing. Um, he's full of energy and passion, and, uh, and he cares about George Jenkins. He really could be at a lot of other schools or in a lot of other, pro of other professions, but he chooses to be at George Jenkins because he loves it. And so you can always count on Mr. Morocco being there to support our kids. It means a whole heck of a lot. Uh, I love this school, and I feel very honored. Thank you. If I had to summarize all the amazing things about our school's Teacher of the Year nominee, I would say that he is a teacher who is student-centered, driven by achievement and success, and goes above and beyond for all of our school. He is student-centered because he seeks to build positive relationships with all students in all grade levels and helps meet the specific needs of all of our students. He is driven by achievement and success because he continuously seeks out professional knowledge and learning opportunities for his students and himself. We are extremely fortunate to have our nominee as part of our school family for these reasons and many, many more. Thank you. Going into Mr. Allen's room is one of the highlights of my day. I love to watch him teach. I know what his expectations are with the students. It's a pleasure to work with. are so excited here at James W. Sykes Elementary. Our Teacher of the Year is Ms. Selena Fontaine. She is a extraordinary fifth grade teacher. Selena goes above and beyond when it comes to our students and staff here at Sykes. Selena has won numerous awards. The Model Classroom Grant from the school board grants with Lowe's and other stores to help educate our students in the outdoors with gardening. She thinks of every student as her own kid. That she's super nice, she helps us learn new things. High energy and she's the great teacher. She is fun to be around, makes you smile, and she cares for us like we're her own kids. For all the great things that you do here at Sykes, thank you, 
Ms. Fontaine, and congratulations on being chosen the 2018-19 Teacher of the Year. Congratulations to you, we're so proud of you. I am so excited to announce our school, Gino Dale Learning Center's Teacher of the Year, Ms. Laura Holland. Ms. Holland is such an asset to our school, and if, if I had all day, I could say so many wonderful things about her and what she contributes to our school. Ms. Holland is our LEA facilitator, um, and she assists our students with creating meaningful goals, rigorous goals for our students' IEPs. And Ms. Holland also has a very unique quality of relating to each and every student that we have on our campus. And she's also able to work with our staff um, and, and provide meaningful suggestions and strategies to keep our school day uh, going well. We are so proud of Ms. Holland and we're honored to have her represent us as Teacher of the Year. Ms. Rodriguez is an outstanding educator who has high expectations for her students and guides them to meeting those expectations. She commands her class in a quiet and gentle manner, yet her students know what to do just by a look or a gesture. I had the best teacher last year. She was so talented. She taught us so much. Jalisa Rodriguez is an awesome, amazing teacher and she has this energy that just draws her kids to her and I have to say as a librarian she's a, a phenomenal accelerated reader teacher. Ms. Rodriguez was my teacher last year and she's really smart. Jaleesa's a wonderful teammate. She's always very supportive of us. Jaleesa definitely pushes hard for her students to be very successful. Jaleesa comes in on the weekends and she stays after school or will meet with us um, off campus just to help us get prepared for our week. Ms. Rodriguez is my teacher and I love her class and then she's a really nice teacher. Ashley is passionate about her work. She is organized, she's dependable, she is enthusiastic. Get it out, get ready! Again, get ready! Our Teacher of the Year loves reading and teaching students how to read. She believes in the guided reading program and wants to put that to practice not only in her classroom but school-wide. Our Teacher of the Year has taken the time to train not just our teachers but our paras and support staff on how to implement the procedures of guided reading. Today, you should be asking those high rigor questions I know Ms. Jackson shared some. To have every child become a successful reader. Ms. Madeline helps grow my brain. Good evening, I'm Cindy Cangelis, Principal at Mulberry Middle School, and I'm excited and pleased to announce our 2018-2019 Teacher of the Year, Spencer Katz. Mr. Katz serves as our band teacher and has been at Mulberry Middle School for the last two years. He's done wonderful things since he started at our school. Since Mr. Katz started at Mulberry Middle School, we are working towards becoming a fine arts academy. Mr. Katz has incredible skills for engaging students, building the band program, using assessment, and being a part of our school community. Mr. Katz is a great teacher because he's easy to work with because he taught me how to play the saxophone in just two years. Mr. Katz is a leading factor on our campus and we are very proud to have him. Congratulations, Mr. Katz. One of the things I love about Ms. Aldridge is that she not only has great ideas, she actually follows through and makes them happen with perfection. She works with collaborative planning and looking for new ideas, always open to suggestions. She's always open to, open to direction from other people. Uh, she's always looking for ways to develop and grow as a professional in how she leads in the classroom. Her grading techniques helped me a lot because I was able to learn what I mastered in class. She makes sure that she gets through to every student and makes sure that if 
one teaching method doesn't work for a student, that she tries something else. I think she should be the teacher of the millennium. I give her an A+++. Ms. Jones provides many opportunities in class each week to learn all about music and music concepts, but in a way that all students want to participate. She makes sure that our students are highly engaged in using many different types of modalities to teach our students so that they will excel in the area of music. She is also extremely talented with taking the entire school through a musical program twice a year in our gymnasium, packed with parents because they can't wait to see the wonderful production that will happen. When I hired a teacher eight years ago, I knew that she was a jewel and she has lived up to that shiny, sparkling diamond. Every time when I get off from school, she hugs me and she say bye. Our Teacher of the Year is tenacious. She goes after whatever she wants for children. I like that Miss Willis is a really kind person and I really like that she was able to teach me like everything that I know now. From a classroom teacher, to this year, our math coach and in the Aspiring Leaders program, she has success for children written all over her based on what she does daily. Mr. Joyner is a phenomenal robotics teacher. His unwavering support of the students and staff is why he is endeared by so many. He is organized. Uh, punctual, is engaged with the students. He never stops giving us like hope for what we do and he inspires me. Mr. Jornier is a really caring and fun robotics teacher because he is a hard working teacher and he loves what he does. He is a fun and great teacher who can make you laugh at any given time with his robotic humor. Mr. Joyner has always been willing to go above and beyond, serve our students, our community, our staff, our school in general. Union Academy is proud to present Mr. Bryant Joyner as our Teacher of the Year.